We told you. Hey, giant. <laughs> hey, giant TV people. people. <laughs> That's got to be the best one yet, that has. Oh. So we've just come out to price an extension. Uh, we've just been told by the customer that there's been quite a few builders um, to come out and have a look at this to give, a, to give an estimate of a price. And I'd like to think we're the best of the bunch because we've picked up on a few things that the other builders haven't. So I thought I'd share it with you people at home to show that we are genuine and we know what we're doing. So we have this house here, give it a tickle. There's dairy milk in the background. It's my humble assistant today. Um, so it's already, as you can see, this is, we're currently at the back of the property and this is a two bed semi and this is in Stoke-on-Trent and it's already got an existing single storey extension and what this person's wanting to do is do a double storey extension so take it right the way up there hopefully under permitted development but probably actually with planning permission and when we're just out here surveying the site as I've done videos before we've got we're looking at things like drains so there are the drains And above the single story extension, and this is where he's gonna hide now, so I'm conscious to try and keep him out of the camera, as we've got the electric cables coming down there, which is feeding the house with all the electricity. And it also goes along the soffits, which I'm, so that'll be supplying next door at some point. So that's of this branch here. So for us to build an extension from here going up, the electricity would have to be moved and there's an additional cost. So there's one thing. Now, I don't know if the other builders picked up on that, I'm then looking at surveying the site with regards to can we get access to it. So can we get a mini digger down here to dig out the footings? So the answer to that is yes, we can. But the thing that other builders have missed out and what you guys may have missed out that nobody else has seen apart from me today is that if I sneakily put my camera over next door, you'll see there's a severe drop, which means this wall here, give that a tickle, is a supporting wall. And if we are going to be building this up two storeys we're obviously increasing the weight onto the floor which is then going to be pushing onto that wall so we need to make sure and have some sort of structural survey to make sure that this wall here beneath these gravel boards is going to be strong enough to hold the footings and the weight the additional weight we're going to be putting on top of it with regards to the second storey extension So that, I think, might be a good tip for you people at home, as it's not just about where, where this is, it's where what, what else is around the extension. So as again, it's called the heave. So it's the weight, of the weight of the extension pushing down on the ground, which is then going to push that way. So that wall that's all the way down there is going to be carrying the weight of all this. So a little builder's tip there from us and Dairy Milk, HIMTV. Until next time. <laughs> yeah, baby. See you later.